The 2019 NCAA convention ended with a number of new opportunities focused on the whole student athlete, including a historic association-wide vote adding new independent members to the Board of Governors. The Division I Council made a program permanent allowing the payment for families of athletes to travel to the men's and women's Final Four. The Division I Presidential Forum and Board of Directors discussed academic misconduct concepts to enhance the membership. The Board of Governors endorsed a pilot coach's credentialing system to enhance education and professional development on a variety of topics. The Division I Autonomy Forum passed resolutions on an agent issue, mental health services access, and medical coverage for student athletes. Division II approved a working group that will work to enhance the Division II National Championships festivals. Division III approved a recommendation to require all current and future communications to contain only gender neutral language. Awards were presented during the honor celebration, plenary session, and association luncheon, recognizing many former college athletes and administrators for their impact on college sports. President Emmert gave a state of college sports address where he reflected on how the NCAA has historically been and currently is a positive force of change on social issues. All of these meetings and events are covered in full detail on NCAA.org, so be sure to check it out for more information. Thank you for your continued support of nearly half a million student athletes.